Tonight, more migrant girls are settling in at the convention center after arriving in San Diego today. They joined the hundreds more who have been there since this past weekend. Fox 5's Kasha Gorchik joins us live downtown with what we know. Kasha. Good evening, Kathleen. Well, we saw two different arrivals this evening, totaling 225 young girls arriving here, and they join hundreds of others already receiving shelter and care here at the convention center. Several buses arrived at the San Diego Convention Center Wednesday evening. The Department of Health and Human Services saying 225 migrant girls were expected. As of Tuesday, there were 723 girls. The new group brings the total up to 948 migrant girls currently being housed here. I've been back to the center multiple times, um, and we have daily conference calls with our federal partners, uh, providing feedback on what we see needs improvement, uh, areas we think are going well, recognizing that what's happening here in San Diego is going to be replicated in other parts of this country uh, in, in hopes of making sure this humanitarian crisis is dealt with. The total capacity at San Diego's emergency intake site for unaccompanied migrant children is around 1,400 beds. Health officials say the number of positive COVID-19 cases remains the same at 82 cases with no girls needing to be hospitalized. The girls are separated on different floors based on whether they have the virus or have been exposed to limit the spread. The girls are receiving shelter, care and also education while waiting to be paired up with family or sponsors in the U.S. This is really not a San Diego thing. This is an American thing. This is what we do in this country. We take care of vulnerable people. And there is room for about 500 more girls. We are told they will continue to arrive until the center reaches capacity. Reporting live downtown, Kasha Grigorczyk, Fox 5 News. Kasha, thank you.